Hello, it's about 9 o'clock Saturday on the November 9th, 74.3 degrees here. There we go. Had to blow out that other garbage. Today, we're going to be cooking this wonderful stuff I had in the steamer. I'm sure it looks great. Right there. This is turkey and this is vegetables or yeah vegetables and rice underneath. So I take this out. I already used the steamer to do all that stuff. Okay, here comes the fun. This is my new way of pick. And I'm plugging it in, you'll hear a beep. I'll wipe it down. Warm water, from a sponge. Make sure it's a nice and clean surface. And I got this beautiful wok right here for my dad and the spatula thingy here. And it looks all clean and clear here. I got it up out here. There you go, induction stove tops right there. Yes, I had to point that out. So, <clears throat> today we're just going to put all the stuff in steam in, like that. Looks beautiful. And then, you can put curry, whatever. I'm going to try this uh, Campbell Skillet Sauces of Thai Green Curry with lemongrass and basil. Okay. I'll pour that on top, like so. And squeeze it all up, both sides. I got this at, uh, I believe, yeah, I got this at Jules, actually. I think it was for about two or three dollars. And the seasoning soup aisle. I'm talking about the seasoning here I'm putting in. Okay. Then I gotta make sure I got this good enough here. Have it centered. Let's see what I'm doing. And the mess behind, yes. So we'll just chop it up, fold it apart. Push it together. Like so. And then it starts mixing. And this works so good. This spatula is awesome with this block. Great idea. Thank you very much for this block and computer other stuff. And keep in mind I have it set to low. Let me put it down again. I have it set to low at 100 degrees. 130. Press start. You hear the fan. It will say low and medium low here. And you can turn it up or down 10 degrees. And then add some butter. It says oil, but I'd rather use butter. So I'm grabbing the butter from the fridge. And I use country crock. And 
I'll just put a, a big old blob. I don't know. I don't measure. I don't think the other people measure. Why should I, right? So, we're just going to move this all around the skillet. All around sides. Just like so. See it melting? Starting to make the popping sound. Yep, just like so. Almost lost the camera there. Alright, we're still going. Good. Alright. Big glove right here in the middle. And I'm just going to bash it down, flatten it, turn upside down. Kick it away from me. That's what I call it my method. Let's see if I can hold the camera and do this at the same time. It's called kicking the, all the food away. See it nice and melted. Flip it. Smash it. Whatever makes it look good and sound, sounds good, right? Going with this. So I guess this on the handle here. There we go. It's starting to look really good. There is a uh, corn, broccoli, carrots in here, red peppers. Uh, there's also mushroom, rice, and slices of turkey pieces from a turkey breast that we cooked. So I just even it out there a little bit. And uh, that's about it. This should make probably about I don't know, at least eight servings or more. Well still cooking at 130. So I could probably turn it off now. So to turn it off, you have to hit program clear twice for zero. Then I unplug it, even though the fan's supposed to be running, but it's not for some reason. But I guess it's good enough. And this is my meal for Saturday night, for November. It's Thai green curry with lemongrass and uh, basil um, from Campbell's and cooking with a 14 inch wok and spatula and the, the best revolutionary new way pick. It's about a hundred bucks for it a piece and if you buy two I think it's like 89 or 87 dollars a piece. Other than that, say thanks for watching.